Washington Bullets and scored 16 points, 7 assists, and 6 rebounds in the Bulls' win. Also, 1984, Charles Barkley made his debut for the Sixers. Uh -oh. He had 11 points, 6 rebounds, and a block in 27 minutes. It was a 10-point win. And then the all-time assist leader, John Stockton, also played his first game that year and had four points, five assists, two steals for the Jazz as they lost that game against the Supersonics. And a year later, Patrick Ewing, Ewing debuted for the Knicks. The number one overall pick had 18 points and six rebounds in 44 minutes against the Sixers, but the Knicks lost that Please game. Please tell me y'all know the song in the background. Push it. Push it real good. Okay, okay. Just check it. Just check it. This check is, yeah. So Vince, right. you played against, you want to keep feeling old? You played yeah. against all of those Hall of Famers. I did. And I want to do a little, little story time with okay. you. So let me set the stage. Stage. It's 2003, mm -hmm. All Star Game. Ah. It's in Atlanta. Atlanta. Tell me. So 2003 in Atlanta, MJ's last All Star Game. Mm. And it was, uh, I was. Janae and I were on our way to grade school. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the NBA, uh, if you would, kind of encourage, hey, it's probably a good idea that MJ starts in his last game. Mm -hmm. That was a no-brainer for me, sure. but, you know, you go through all the protocols, and I remember walking in All-Star, you know, all of the festivities, you know how All-Star Weekend is. This is bananas, and MJ's in, in the back doing what MJ does with, with Ahmad and all those guys, and I walk in, and I said, hey, MJ, um, you know, it's your last All-Star game and everything. You're going to start. He said, no, you earned it. I said, no, 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 you don't hear me. <laughs> You're going to start because I didn't want to get blackballed. I didn't want the NBA and the world like, how, you, how is Michael how did you take finally, spot? Yeah, how is he not starting his last All-Star game? Yeah. So he's like, no, 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 you earned it. Go ahead, go ahead. So I go back in, get dressed, and I'm like, man, there's no way. So I go shoot, and right here, that's, that conversation right there is where I'm telling him. And he's telling me, he said, he's like, you earned it. I said, You're going to do it. So I said, MJ, look here. I am going to walk into the back of the locker room during starting lineups because I'm not go you're going to start I'm not about to get black ball so I started walking in the back and they call him out boom he walks out starting lineup and everything good right here you see patented MJ fadeaway yes. over Sean Marion I mean if you notice right here nothing but net we tried our best we're yelling to stop the game right yeah. there it was like seven seconds I think we're saying stop the game stop the game yep. well rest in peace to Kobe Bryant being Kobe Bryant he wanted to win the game, oh. field the show. So he gets the ball out of a timeout. He gets fouled by Jermaine O'Neal, hits both free throws, and we lose. Oh, <laughs> oh my we god! We end up losing that game, Look but it, 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 was, it was it was memorable to just watching MJ uh, for the last time in All Star game. And you know, I grew up watching MJ and mm -hmm. shooting the fadeaway, and he hits it right there in that moment, All Star game. We were like NBA, this is it. This is yeah. how you close. In, in error in in an unbelievable career from MJ, but so so that's MJ. What wow. what, what about Patrick Ewing? Uh, <laughs> well, Pat Pat Ewing is one of my guys, and if he's watching this, he's gonna be mad. Love you, Pat. But uh, <laughs> but you know, I, I as as a young dunker, you know, I, I come in. Uh, you know, you have a dunk list. I had a dunk list, and there were just guys that I wanted to dunk on who I respected as great shot. Blockers. I need a copy of this list, please. Right? <laughs> Run it back, please. I mean, we, we saw Olajuwon earlier, and, and obviously Patrick, Patrick Ewing is one of the guys that I respect. And, and I mean, sorry once again for the green. It was a little older. This was a while ago. <laughs> but um, for some reason, you see my reaction here. It's like I was excited. So I typically, after a dunk or a highlight, I don't really go home and go watch Sports Center. Sports Center was around. Yeah, I don't really go home and watch Sports Center. Yeah, you're not that old, Vince. Come on now. Yeah, but I don't go and watch highlights like that. But for some reason that night, I went home to to watch that highlight that I dunked on Patrick Ewing. It was I don't, I don't know, and you can see the excitement in that. Some dunk, reason so. he says for some reason, no, not because like, like I wanted yeah. to go and get some popcorn and put my feet up. I would have done the same thing. I was checking the box. Like I would have Yeah, I, I, no, it, it was just something like yes, I dunked on Patrick Ewing, and that was some excite, excitement in in that dunk. You know, it was pretty cool. Well, you know who who might watch back their dunks? I'm not sure about this or not, but maybe Giannis Antetokounmpo because the Bucks are on ESPN's power rankings. We're going to talk about that coming up. Who else Ooh. is on there? I think was it the Jazz?